Fans of Avatar The Last Airbender finally got some good news as it was just revealed the series is getting a AAA game that, according to the developers, will literally be massive. This is huge. That's what she said. What to do, Direct Nation? I'm back with Super News Bits to give you the latest superhero news in three minutes or less because I respect your time if you subscribe. So if this video was helpful, hit the like button so it reaches more people. But if it wasn't for you, change it to a dislike. In my opinion, Avatar The Last Airbender is an IP that has not gotten the proper respect. The original series was one of the best shows of the last 30 years, and it was rewarded with a movie adaptation by M. Night Shyamalan, which most agree is one of the top five worst movies ever, and he should have been thrown in prison for making it. The Legend of Korra was a solid follow-up, but most fans wanted to explore more stories, especially around the original cast in both movies, shows, and games. And while Netflix attempted to give it the live-action One Piece treatment, though with much less impressive results, they are finally getting a proper AAA video game for the first time since the PlayStation 2. And no, Fortnite doesn't count. The announcement was made by popular video game publisher Saber Interactive and media giant Paramount. Saber has been doing really good work over the years, becoming famous for that incredible swarm system they've shown off in their World War Z game, as well as the recent smash hit Space Marine 2. Saber is also currently in charge of the Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic remake. Them taking on Avatar makes me very excited based on their track record, but fans of Aang and the original crew will be a bit disappointed. The new Avatar game is reportedly the biggest they have ever made and will be an action RPG. However, the story takes place 1,000 years in the past and will star a never before seen Avatar. This means even older Avatars like Kyoshi will not have been born yet, and this could potentially be the Avatar that directly preceded the Fire Nation's Avatar Zeto, who is the oldest known of the avatars. Despite having a new cast of characters, the core of what made you love the series is said to be intact. You'll be able to explore the world, learn all the elements, and meet new companions to join you on your adventures. If the game is delivered with the same or better quality than Warhammer 40k, I'm happy with the trade-off of a new story with original characters instead of what's familiar. Saber has been doing a lot of licensed games, and I'm hoping they were listening when I pitched my idea for them to make an open-world Marvel Zombies game or Teen Titans with DC Comics. Speaking of DC, it looks like PlayStation is no longer satisfied with having their own Marvel games and is looking to expand their reach into DC. Click the video on screen to learn more.